I think there is no other option uh, today uh, for Greece than uh, to agree uh, uh, and to have an agreement uh, between uh, the uh, political authorities in Greece, uh, the government of Greece, and, and uh, the Troika. Uh, because it's, uh, as you know, the only way uh, to uh, liberate the necessary uh, money and the necessary credit lines uh, that are absolutely needed uh, by uh, Greece uh, uh, to avoid a bankruptcy. But let me be very blunt also uh, immediately by saying that um, this is not enough. There is an absolute need in the, uh, in the near future, the fastest as possible, uh, to put together such a package of structural reforms that can launch Greece again on the path of economic growth with the reforms going until 2020. So we need an agenda from now until 2020 for economic and political reforms in debt reforms. I don't like these ideas. Uh, there was an idea at a certain moment coming from uh, the Ministry of Finance of, of Germany, I think, a few weeks ago to say, oh, we shall send somebody. Oh, I think I, I know a number of uh, countries where you can send somebody uh, from, from the Commission uh, uh, and uh, to control uh, an, an, a number of facts and, 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 and findings. I have a long list. My list is very long in the, the way that 12, no, what I'm saying, 14 of the 17 countries are not fulfilling the conditions of the Treaty of Maastricht. No, 14 of 17. It, it, it's only Estonia, uh, Luxembourg and Finland for the, uh, for the moment uh, were in, in fact uh, uh, yeah, respecting the two criteria of Maastricht. The 14 others uh, don't respect them. And 12 of them, including Germany and France and Belgium and Italy and Spain and so on and so on, are not fulfilling both criteria of the Treaty of Maastricht. So if you want to send somebody, I should say, yeah, to everybody who is not fulfilling the criteria. Huh? Uh, so, th th I'm saying that because I'm a little bit uh, hesitating to say, oh yeah, it's a fantastic idea, I want first of all to see what's behind the idea before to say uh, yes. Because the last two years we have seen all these beautiful ideas of Merkel and Sarkozy have not solved the crisis at all. It were always half measures. Economy as well as in politics, uh, 